Frustration is mounting in France. Many people are angry about the government's harsh austerity policies, including Christine Apiani. The government is planning public spending cuts of 50 billion euros. Our work creates additional wealth. If we didn't work, there wouldn't be a cake to share out in the first place. So the government is doing exactly the opposite of what it's supposed to be doing. They should increase wages, not reduce them. Economist Philippe Crevel says the tough stance taken by the labor unions is a problem. In comparison to Germany, it's extremely difficult to implement reforms in France. The parties don't easily agree on things here. First, the unions flex their muscles by going on strike. If that doesn't work, they might negotiate. It's different in Germany. The parties start with discussions, and they only take to the streets if that doesn't work. Jean-Jacques Courillon is pleased the French government wants to help businessmen like him by cutting corporate taxes and 10 billion euros in ancillary wage costs. But he says those measures won't be enough. The austerity plans are going in the right direction, but they don't go far enough. They're just minor reforms, and putting them into action won't be cheap. Courriel makes sport uniforms and equipment, but he says it's hard to keep up with the international competition. Our competitors mainly come from Asia. We have to match their prices, although our production costs are up to 15 times higher than theirs. Courriel thinks the French government should make it easier for companies to lay off staff. But in his opinion, for small businesses like his, the worst hindrance is bureaucracy. The simplest payroll calculations have 16 different entries. That means you have 16 different kinds of contributions. The system is unbelievably complicated. Difficulties facing French companies are impacting the labor market. The economy is stagnating. More than 10% of the workforce is unemployed. Crevel believes France's neighbor Germany knows the secret to recovery. The country also pushed through hard reforms. Germany is a real role model. The country has a 200 billion euro export surplus, while in France we import a lot more than we export. The German budget is balanced, unlike in France. And German companies are more competitive. Their profits are higher. In France, typical profit margins are around only 25%. But not everyone in France looks to Germany as an example of how things should be. Germany is anything but a role model for us. They only talk about productivity. In France, we think about the people who are responsible for that. We introduced the minimum wage first, and now Germany is copying that from us. With so much frustration at home, France's path out of the economic crisis is likely to be fraught with difficulties.